Welcome back Focus Fanatics. In this video I will walk you through adding a menu item to a canvas. Now there's a couple different ways you can actually add menu items. And I'm going to show you the way that I find the easiest, the most helpful, and just the easiest to learn. So the first thing I normally do is go to Menu, Canvas Designer. You can see you can access the menu item database directly by going to the menu items but we're, we're going to go the easy way and just go to the Canvas Designer. And so the next thing we do is, let's say we want to add a tuna salad. And we want to order a tuna salad on our fast food canvas here. What I normally do is select a similar item, because I know my tuna salad button, I want it to be green. So I'm going to go ahead and copy the pasta salad and paste it. Move it around to where I want it. And now I have to actually add my new menu item. So if you look over here, we have item. Let's go ahead and select on this button. And it pops up our menu item database. All we have to do is click on add. And it's going to use these options that are already set for us as a template. So we can go ahead and click add and we want to add a tuna salad so I just hit tab and it fills in all the information for us the menu names what you're going to see on the screen the check name is going to be printed on the check for the customer the remote name is the name that will be printed to the kitchen the ID is a unique unique name used throughout the um, menu item database and the inventory ID is used for inventory purposes. And our tuna salad, we're going to want to change the price. We'll just use price 1. By default, we'll just make it $12.95. And just verify everything else correct. It has a sales tax associated with it. It is printed on a guest check. And it's printing to the salad printer group. So from this point, all we have to do is click Save and Close. Now you see it's still highlighted over here. So our item, we can simply search for our tuna salad. We get our tuna salad right here. And we are done. Now there's a couple tweaks you can uh, use. You'll notice all these other salads. You have the pasta salad. Uh, pasta is actually on top of the word salad. In order, and the way we achieve that is by manipulating one of the fields on the menu item setup. So we go to tuna salad over here. Let's access our menu item database again. And we are actually going to put a carrot. And that's going to be shift and the number six to put a little carrot in there. We're going to get rid of the spaces. So now when we save it, you'll see it's up and down like that. So if you have really long names for your menu items. This really helps out. Well that's my way. Uh, I prefer to set up new menu items on canvases. I hope it's helpful. Thanks for tuning in Focus Fanatics. Until next time, stay focused.